In question 8 of the exercise, we have to solve this equation 1.6 is equal to y divided by 1.5. So the variable in this equation is y which occurs on the right hand side and we have to separate this variable and find its value. To do that, we can multiply both sides of the equation by 1.5 because that will get help us get rid of this 1.5 in the denominator on the RHS. So let's do that. Let's multiply both sides of this equation by 1.5. Uh, so what will happen on the LHS? So we will get 1.6 into 1.5 and on the RHS we will have y divided by 1.5 into 1.5. So on the RHS these two terms cancel out and we are left with only y on the RHS. So we get 1.6 into 1.5 that's 2.4, 2.4 verify that it is 2.4 and on the RHS we will we are left with only y. So the solution of the equation is y is equal to 2.4 and we can verify that it is correct. If we substitute this value into the original equation, we will get 1.6 on the LHS. On the RHS, we will get 2.4 divided by 1.5 and we can verify that this quotient is equal to 1.6. Okay. Um, also, multiplying both sides by 1.5, we could have written it in a shorthand way. So, the original equation is 1.6 is equal to y by 1.5 the way we can think about this is take this 1.5 in the denominator into the numerator on the LHS. So directly we can write 1.6 into 1.5 is equal to y and this gives us y is equal to 2.4. So this is a slightly shorter way of doing the exact same thing that we did earlier multiplying both sides by 1.5. So this completes question 8 and the answer of question 8 is y is equal to 2.4. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.